one to left. And it will go! Four to one. On the Waveland Avenue, and I mean a bomb <laughs> by Brian. Wow. I'm Matt Wehmeyer with the MLB.com FastCast. Chris Bryant's 28th home run of the season, a 414-foot shot that landed on Waveland Avenue, along with a solo blast from Wilson Contreras, helped lift the Cubs to a 5-1 win over the Angels. John Lackey turned in eight innings of one-run ball against his former team, striking out six to pick up his ninth win of the season. According to sources at MLB.com, a second neck surgery for Prince Fielder will force the end of his playing career. Fielder underwent surgery for a herniation in his neck back on July 29th after undergoing a similar procedure back in 2014. The Rangers will hold a press conference on Wednesday afternoon. Now let's take a look at the rest of Tuesday's action. Left field, come on Nelly! To third, bobbled by Upton! Tie ball game! Lynn to third, yes sir! Five, five in the 15th! Adam Lynn tags, on time! Here's the throw! Lynn digging for home, he wins it! Mike Zanino! And the Mariners win it in 15! Right back up the middle and that's that. Lindor with a one-out single. Lindor breaks up the no-hitter. And Ramirez clobbers it. Deep right. It's over. Heisey's heading off the wall. The Indians score first. Ramirez in the second with an RBI double. Jackie up and gunning. Going to be close, and he's out. What a recovery by Jackie Bradley Jr. And here's the Red Sox and Yankees. The yeah. benches are clearing. I think Parcello got into it verbally. The bullpens are emptying. And yeah, nothing's really happened other than Heavy waving his arms toward the pitching mound. Off the fence. This game is tied. Beltre has done it again. Beltre on the way. Blackman's throw offline. Elvis Andrews delivers again. Stanton busts his pass. No feeling off the bat head as the bat head ends up past third base. Mondesi gives it to Escobar. Get the out! Oh my! Woo! And these guys haven't played together all that long, but it seems like they've been playing together forever. And he drives that ball oh to left my. field, and that ball is gone. Oh. Home run, Todd Frazier, his 31st, and the Sox have a three run lead. Springer scores. Here's Bregman behind him, and the Astros tie it 4-4. That smacked into center field. He's 4-4. Four four. Two of the hits coming on 0-2 counts, and it's 6-4 Houston. There's a solid single in the center by Tyler Holt, and that's going to give the Reds the lead one more time at 5-4. Holt into second base with a two-base hit. Away back. It is gone. Randolph continues. His remarkable hitting, and Turner drives one to left center field and deep, and that ball is gone. Over the wall and out. Bautista's going to go to the wall. Gone! Home run to the opposite field for Logan Forsythe. In the left center field, well tagged. Extra bases. Kiermaier's going to score. It'll be a double for Longoria. There's a fly ball deep. Right center field. Three of on deck. Cannonball coming for Al Cafe. Gives the Pirates the lead. It's 5-2. to two. Three run bomb. That one is headed for right center. It's going to get all the way to the wall. Owing scores. Goslin right behind. And Michael Bourne is headed for third with a two run triple. Ground ball up the middle. That's going to sneak through for a hit. They're going to bring Kemp around third. Broxton's throw to the plate is late. Garcia with a base hit puts Atlanta in front, two to one. Three two pitch runner goes strike three called on the outside corner, and that will do it. Ben Zach Neal gets the win. For more on these stories and for complete coverage from around the majors, keep it locked in to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.